welcome back to the Mr. Excel podcast. I'm Bill Jalen. Today we're going to talk about a very specific problem where we have to number the customer records. I have here some invoice data and it's sorted by invoice number. I want to find every invoice for Ford and number them in order. One, two, three, four, five. And when we get to the next customer, start over numbering one, two, three, four, five. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to sort this data by customer. I'm going to click the A to Z button to sort by customer. And then I'm going to insert a new column, insert column, calling it uh, number. And of course, for the first record, we just use the number one. After that, though, the formula is an if function. We want to say equal if the customer in this row is equal to the customer in the row above us, then we want to use one plus the number above. Otherwise, if it's a new customer, we want to start over with one. Enter that, double click the fill handle to copy it down, and we've effectively added a series of invoice numbers from one to 52 for Ainsworth, and then for Air Canada, starts over at number one, two, three, four. Now, once we have this formula in, we can copy the whole range with control C, and then use paste special values to convert the live formulas to values. We have that, we can now sort by invoice number, and we've effectively assigned a sequential number to every customer's invoice. Hey, thanks for stopping by. We'll see you tomorrow for another podcast from Mr. Excel.